we'll guide you through how to schedule WhatsApp messages on your iPhone. If you find this guide useful, then please consider subscribing and liking the video. First of all, we need to go and close out of WhatsApp, just like so. And then what we need to do is open up the shortcuts app. So for me, it's on the second page, so I can then go and open it up like this. What we can do is set up an automation which will go and send a scheduled message. So click on the plus button in the top right of the page, and then you want to search or just click on time of day. Mine's right at the top here. You can then choose when this happens. So for me, I'll have it happen at two o'clock, for example, and then you can click off that. You can choose the when it repeats. So personally, I'll just set it to monthly. I only want it to happen once, but after it's happened, I can just go and delete the automation. And then what you want to do is make sure run immediately is selected and then press next in the top right. Then you want to go and click on new blank automation like this. And you then need to click on it, add action. And you then need to select apps like this. And then you can search for WhatsApp or you can just scroll for it. Click on WhatsApp and we can then see what we can do and we can go and send a message. So go to the right and press on the plus button. You can then type in where it says message, what you want it to say. I'll just type in hello for the example and then click on recipients. And then you can click on recipients and you can type in who you want it to be. So I'll go and type in, you could add multiple people here as well and then press done in the top right. And that's it. And just to test that it works, click on the play pause button in the bottom right just like this, and then it will go and run it. And then if we come to WhatsApp, as you can see, we just sent a message which says hello using the automation. Then you can press done in the top right, and at two o'clock on the 20th, a message will be sent. And as I said, after it's sent, and you've sort of finished with the schedule, and you can just swipe across here and delete it, and then it will stop sending it every month.